Okay, so in this video, we're going to learn how to test for validity. So how to judge that an argument is valid. And so the test given in the book is at the top of page 77. And that's under the section, how to judge for validity, uh, toward the bottom there. Okay. And it says this at the top of page 77. You read, whether or not they are actually true, suppose or pretend that the premises were all true. Then, in such a situation, aside from how things actually are, could the conclusion conceivably be false? Okay. If it cannot be false, then the argument is valid. If it could be false, then the argument is invalid. So that's the top of page 77. Normally when they have things in those little boxes, it's a little bit extra important. <coughs> so I'm gonna write these on the board. So, um, um, how to test for validity. Okay. And the first thing you do is they talk about is pretend the premises are true. Okay. And that's regardless of whether they're actually true, like it says. Then ask, um, could the conclusion conceivably be false? Okay. So let's pretend the premise are true. Could you conceive conceive of the conclusion as false? And then, if yes, then it's valid. Uh, so, uh, yeah, it, it, it's invalid. <laughs> if no, then it's valid. Okay. And uh, in the next video, we'll look at some some examples of this. But that's your test for judging for validity.